Hi, I'm Krista Nelson, founder of Just Get It Done Now, Dream Life Coach. We're talking about how you can create the life of your dreams in six steps or less. The first step was keeping a journal. And the second step was making that journal vivid. Today's video, the third step, is about identifying your preferences. So you're writing in your journal, this is what I did today. And you've learned to make it vivid. This is what I saw, this is what I smelled, this is what I heard, this is what I touched. This is what my life was like today. Now you're going to comment on it. You know in uh, social networking, you hit a like button or a recommend button. You could say, yes, I like this, or thumbs up, or thumbs down. That's what you're gonna do to your own words. I went to the market. I got there in the rain, I visited my neighbors, I was looking for mangoes, I bought some string beans, and I'm going to read over that and say, I don't like string beans, but I do like mangoes. I liked going to the store, but I didn't like going in the rain. So what you're going to do <laughs> is you're going to write, what did I do today? You're going to make it vivid, and you're going to read over your own words and comment. You can use pluses and minuses, or just the word yes, or the word no. I like this, I didn't like this. A happy face, you know, a little smiley face, or an unhappy face. If you're using your computer, that's so easy to do, right? You can put in that little emotion text. And this is a critical step because you are telling yourself you're stopping the madness, you're stopping the routine of your life and saying, I've been doing this, but I don't like this so much. I woke up this morning, I put on my robe and my slippers in my yellow room on my carpeted floor. You read that over and you say, I really don't like the yellow and I'd rather have hardwood floors. Or, you know, I don't have any windows in my room. You know, because you wrote about that in the description, the, the windowless room. Whatever it is, start commenting on it. These are your preferences, what you like and what you don't like. And it's a very, very important step in identifying what you want to see in your dream life. So, forge ahead. Keep a journal. Make it vivid. Comment. Identify your preferences. And just get it done now. You'll be really glad that you did. If you need more information right now, go to justgetitdonenow.com and figure out what all the six steps are in advance. Or tune into my next video, number four. You're going to like that step. So exciting. You actually get to rewrite history. And you use gratitude, which is the, the gateway attitude. You take everything as a blessing. You're going to love it. Come back for step four. See you then.